Hey guys, so it's been ages and I'm actually doing this on my iPhone because I really didn't want to bring my like proper camera today. But basically, I am, it's my birthday tomorrow, it's my 24th birthday. Fuck, I'm getting old. Um, and I decided to kind of splurge in the sense that um, I got this amazing hotel room tonight to celebrate my birthday. And um, just because I've been so busy with work, I haven't really been doing anything fun. And, um, and I haven't been uploading on YouTube either. And that's part of the fact that I actually work in social media. So when you're doing that pretty much in 10 hours a day, you really don't feel like doing it on the weekend either. So that's kind of an, a little bit of an update for you. Um, I hope the footage is gonna be nice. It's my iPhone 6, so hopefully it's really good. But um, I thought I would show you around this fucking hotel room because it's amazing. So I'm staying at the Old Clare. I'm gonna not try to give too much away, but I'll take you kind of from the start and then we'll go through. Um, but yeah, that's the door. And well, obviously that's the door, so that you're an idiot. Okay, so I'll just kind of take you through. Okay, so this is the first thing you see when you come in. Um, there's two chairs, I've just left my kind of bag over here, and then that's my jacket, and there's this amazing like old style lamp um, over here. It's a phone. And then this is the actual room, and I'm going to be a crazy person and enjoy it. So I think this is like the, I don't know what the purpose of this is. So obviously a little sink and this massive mirror, and then there's a coffee machine in there. I think there's like the, whatever you call it with the condiments thing, the mini bar. Oh, there's some nice glasses for some wine in a second. Um, I think there's a mini bar in here as well. Let me see what's in here. Um, gross, there's like Bundaberg rum and then some other shit that's not really appealing at all. Um, and how great is the lighting? I feel like I'm gonna take like a million selfies here. Um, but yeah, I really don't understand why that's there. Maybe you wanna wash your hands the first time you come in. Don't know. So moving on to the amazing element. Can you believe this? So this is my living room. This is the fucking amazing light. Uh, and then this is, I think it's a rag and bone lamp. That's what the person who um, showed me the room said. It's a rag and bone lamp. Let's see if it actually says rag and bone. I don't know. Anyway, so this is amazing. Art, I think it's art deco chair and then that's the bed. Girl, let me get on the bed. <laughs> yes! Oh, fuck, I look so bad. <laughs> this is the bed, and it's so nice. And, like, look at this. Look at this. Just look at it. Um, And, yeah, and then behind there is the bathroom. Okay, let's go. This is the bathroom. It's all connected, obviously. It's all connected. And let's have a little bit of a stroll to the bathroom. Amazing lighting. This is like the most amazingly lit apartment ever. I wish I could live here. It's pretty much my dream apartment. Um, and then there's this little thing here as well. And I was taking some, oh, look at that. Oh, look at that light. Look at that contour. Oh, yes. Yes. So I'm going to get ready here very soon because I'm going out. And actually one of my friends is coming up to get ready with me. And yeah. This is obviously the massive tub. I don't know if I'm going to use it. That's the toilet. Um, and then this is the shower. And I think they have like really nice stuff in here. I think this is Triumph and Disaster. Which actually, let me have a little. Ooh, girl, it smells good. It smells good. So yeah, that's the room. Can you believe how nice it is? I'm literally dying. Um... Let's have a little bit of a talk because I feel like it hasn't, it's been so long since I've kind of given you guys an update. But yeah, the last few months have been like absolutely crazy for me. Um, so I think the last time I put a video up was probably sometime last year, at the end of last year. And last year was like the worst year of my life. I just had a lot of things that were, that didn't go to plan, I feel. Or that, like, I just didn't expect things to turn out the way they did. And, um, 
yeah, it was not a great year. It was a great year for learning. Like, I felt like I learned a lot and I feel like I'm really grown now. Like, the word grown, I said not like old, but like grown. I feel like I've matured a lot. Um, but yeah, I'm actually now really at a good place and both in terms of work and just how I feel about myself. Um, yeah, I just feel really grown and like, I was like, I really just want to celebrate what I've done, not what I've done, but like how I've kind of matured. I feel I really just wanted to celebrate that. And that's why I was like, I'm going to blow all this money on this amazing place. And, um, yeah, I'm so happy that I did. And I think, ooh, that better not be wrinkles. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just think, like, one of the things you really need to do is just, if something's not working, you have to fix it. And sometimes things don't... I think that's part of growing up. Things don't go to plan. They never go to plan. And <laughs> the biggest lesson I've learned over the last year has, has been that, you know, you have to let it go. If you, whether you're at work, whether it's in a relationship, whether it's anything, if it's, it's just not, never going to be in your control. And so you just have to let it go. And that's kind of the biggest lesson I've learned. And if I can impart anything, if it, even if it isn't fashion or anything other related, that's it. Let things go and let people go. Let opportunities go. Let jobs go. If you don't feel like you're actually getting anywhere in them, let career paths go if you don't feel like you're passionate about it. That's life. Life's too short. Um, wow, I love this lighting, even though I look really crusty because I've been at work all day. Um, actually, I left work really early. I feel like this is going to be a really weird vlog because I'm literally just talking. Um, so if you guys don't want to watch it, you're not watching it, you can tune out. But I kind of am enjoying catching up with you guys. So... Yeah, um, tonight I am going out to party and I um, actually don't know what I'm wearing. I have two options. One's like all white and with like brown suede shoes and the other one's um, black jeans and this like khaki colored shirt that I have from ASOS. I might show you guys later. Um, but I'm kind of double man minded because I just don't feel like either of them are very like I just don't know. I, sometimes you're like, oh, I just don't know whether this is really me or not if I'm trying too hard and I don't want to do that because I'm too grown to be trying hard for anyone or anything. But yeah, I'm just like really in a good place and I hope you guys are as well and let, let me know how you all are doing down below. Um, I'm trying to, I'm really bad at remembering names, but like I always remember people's usernames and there's a lot of people that I've, I, like I'm always responding to that over the years have continued watching. Oh my god, guys, I'm so happy. This is like the most amazing thing ever. Oh, I'm gonna take so many selfies. Okay, I'm gonna tune out for now. Bye. Hey guys, yes! Okay, I'm actually like a little bit tipsy now and the lighting's not that great because I'm like getting ready. Let me show you what I'm wearing. Okay. Oh, yes. Okay, let me give you a sec. So I am wearing just like a white granddad shirt and then if you can see I've got this chain which is kind of like a choker but in reality it's just a chain. It has this ring that I got on my 21st so I'm wearing it today. In honour of that, I have another shirt that I can show you tomorrow but I was like this just feels me. It feels very like casual, like it's it just feels really casual but still like me and I wanted to just you know. I didn't want to wear something slutty, too slutty, because it's just not who I am. But this is like perfect. And I'm wearing like black jeans and boots. So yeah, I'm gonna leave and my face looks pretty on fleek, but you can't see. Okay, see ya.